three, four years ago. I already had like a five year master plan. One thing to do and one thing only is, well, to drink and rehearse. And we did both in copious quantities. We actually started, um, Aaron, Tony, Tommy and I had a pre-rehearsal rehearsal going on here in LA. Um, it was just the four of us. I mean, no electronics, just, you know, no click or anything. Like, we were just bashing out the songs. By the time we get out there, we're pretty, as far as playing-wise, we're, we're pretty good. Uh <laughs> Apart from Al throwing skunks in my bed and, and had throwing dead owls everywhere and putting them on car roofs, it was like being, being a monk for a, a month. I'm sure Tommy will say he hated it because I found a dead skunk in the road and while he was sleeping I came in and beat him over the head with it. used it as a prop, you know, like I was throwing my guitar against it, sticking in there, and then, uh, uh, so within a couple of weeks it was pretty destroyed and they had to fix it up again, so I was banished from using it as a prop after that. I mean, there was a lot of kids that, that were there that, that only knew Rio Grande Blood and, and uh, you know, Houses of the Mole and, uh, and The Last Sucker, you know, it's just, it just like a new generation of fans. It's different every night. I, I, would, I would really question the person that said that, like, the same song kickstarts them every night because that means that the rest of the set's pretty shitty. Balloons. Yay, balloons. <laughs> that was the, uh, the joke. I personally was obsessed with the balloon drop every night. Oh, yeah! I thought that was awesome. Um, it was just like a cool kind of end, you know, to the set. Oh, I think that there was... Al enjoyed that moment more than anything. It was you know, this is what I do this for the balloon fall. I, I don't know why. It was like that's the only nostalgic thing about the whole thing. It was just like I get all happy like a five year old on his birthday party when the balloons drop and the clown came in or something. It was like... We're a fucking rock band. Get over it.